Hey, hey, everybody. It's the Review Revolution. Back at you with another Manny Collector game day. It's the July game day. Um, just a brief pause to kind of reflect on the June game day. Uh, a couple of people kind of asked about it. Uh, it was crazy. For anybody who was there, it was crazy. Uh, as I mentioned, the reviews for, uh, for the figures that month, I, I shot the video, but... No matter how hard I tried, I was not able to edit it in any way that would make sense. So, yeah, poor, poor June. That 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 one got lost, lost month. But um, quiet month in July. It's kind of quiet for Maddie. Um, this month, there's only two things that are coming up. Uh, first being, of course, the Master Universe Classic Count Marzo Club Attorney figure. So, because he's a Club Eternia figure, I'm not going to be needing to order him today, so that's a little load off. One Master Universe figure I don't have to worry about. Along the, uh, they're discussing the Club Eternia figure this month for July. The 2011 subscriptions open up. Uh, I believe it opens on the 26th, I think. And I think it runs for about six weeks. You can get an all-in subscription, which I am definitely going for. But, uh, yeah, for anyone who's been trying to collect Masters of the Universe, or for anybody who just can't stand these uh, these uh, uh, white screens and this this quick sellout that all in definitely look into it plus the bonus figures you get for subscriptions might not have wanted one dar in the beginning but you might want them now uh, but uh, there's Count Marzo for anybody who uh, who you know hasn't liked the things I've said about the 2002 uh, character designs I will say this. I am very happy about how they redid Count Marzo. His 2000X version is so much better than his Filmation version. I mean, if somebody needed a makeover, this guy needed it bad. So, Count Marzo, uh, a very popular character, was on everyone's list uh, on the uh, on the uh, forum sites as far as a character they wanted to see done, and Maddie gave it to us. For me. I would really like to see Stratos' wife, uh, Delora, or I think uh, Hawk, but uh, she's gone by Delora. I would really like to see her in 2011. I, I certainly hope that uh, that uh, uh, I'm not the only one. She would be a really great figure to get. But again, there's Count Marzo from Filmation, but fortunately we're going to get him in his 2000X version. Very cool. Uh, the other figures that are going to be uh, coming out this month, <clears throat> excuse me, and the ones that I'm really kind of chasing after, is the DC Universe Wave 13. I found bits and pieces of the wave here and there, but I don't know why the, either the Cheetahs or the Blue Devil have just eluded me. I have not been able to find them in stores. So at this point, I'm just going to go ahead. I waited. I'm just going to order them all at one time. But uh, we're looking at about five minutes till the sale opens. So I'm going to go ahead and pause the video and uh, we'll be back and see how things are going. So see you soon. Bye bye. All right, everybody, we're back. Um, we've got just a few seconds before the sale opens. Uh, it's something where I am, despite the fact that I'm only after the uh, DC Universe Classics uh, set which do tend to last longer than the Masters of the Universe. They, they don't sell out quite as fast. I am very interested to see how long it takes for Count Marzo to sell out and see, uh, see uh, what, the, uh, what the wait time is on the, on the load screens. Because it is just the one figure. No bonus, no reissues, just the one Club Eternia figure. So I am kind of wondering if uh, people are going to be stomping all over each other for this one, or is it going to be uh, uh, a little bit easier because there is only one, We're not looking at uh, really any other uh, Justice League Unlimited or Ghostbuster figures. So let's refresh the screen. Sale should be open. Yeah, and there is the Maddie white screen. Now, it is kind of uh, new. They've got a countdown here. Page will refresh in 1, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay. Now it tells me the traffic's still high. So everybody's pushing in the door here. I guess uh, while we wait on the load, um, I just want to say, hey guys, thanks a lot for uh, for subscribing, everybody. Uh, it's something we're up to about 422 subscribers. 
So, 80 more subscribers, and somebody's going to get that Batman and Joker from DC Universe Wave 10. We're, we're reaching the 500 mark. It's, it's exciting. I'm really excited. Thank you, guys. Um, after that, of course, we do have a full set of Wave 10 we'll give to 1,000 subscribers. So, you know, don't, uh, don't, don't go anywhere and tell your friends we still got a full set when we hit 1,000. But... Um, there's a, there's a few other videos that, uh, that I'm going to be doing here soon. Um, something a little bit different from the, uh, from the action figures that I've been doing. Something a little different. Uh, a few web sh sites I want to share with you guys. And uh, some other ideas. So, you know, this is just a good opportunity to go ahead and let everybody know what's going to be coming up with the Review Revolution. And traffic seems to be pretty high. We'll give it uh, we'll give it one more cycle. See what's going on. I don't have my backup computer. I don't have my uh, my other computer set up right now for uh, for the website. Mainly because again, Count Marzo is the one that I was uh, I was after. So in this case, without uh, without having to worry about him, I'm not uh, I'm not in a in a big rush. It's very interesting to be uh, to be sitting here. Going through this without necessarily feeling the uh, the 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 uh, anxiety of 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 missing a figure, it's it's a good feeling. <laughs> it's another reason why I think the uh, the all in subscription is going to be something that I'm really looking forward to, because that anxiety that uh, that uh, that rush, the adrenaline, it, it it's a good feeling when you know you got the figure, but that build up is a killer. Well, we'll go ahead and uh, we'll take a break real quick, and uh, we'll be back once we can get to the order screen. So, see you soon. All right, everybody, we're at the sales screen and or the catalog screen, and I've already ordered my uh, Wave 13 set, so that went through pretty smoothly. It's about six minutes into the sale, and Count Marzo is still here. So, uh, so, so far, it looks as though that uh, Count Marzo is not an instant sellout. Um, production numbers, possibly, couldn't say for sure. Not as popular a character as he might have seemed. I don't know, but not as not an instant sellout. As I mentioned before, the uh, Wave 13s or the the DC Classics uh, figures, yeah, they stick around for uh, for a few days at least, sometimes up to a week. But uh, but the Master Universe, this is kind of surprising. Count Marzo is still here. Um, at this point, we'll give it just a couple of minutes. Refresh every now and then. See if it says uh, almost gone or if uh, if he says sold out. As a matter of fact, while that's doing its thing, just a quick look at what's coming up next month in August. Now, early August, we're all going to see Orko and Adam. But for the regular monthly figure, of course, we'll get Whiplash, another Club Eternia figure, so looking forward to that one. And for everybody back in February who missed him, here is Trapjaw. Highly, highly recommend this figure. If you didn't get him somewhere else, if you uh, were kind of uh, sitting and waiting, Maddie didn't waste too much time, they reissued him pretty quick. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, Ghostbusters fans, looks like we do have the 6-inch Ray Stance and the 12-inch Winston, which every time I see these 12-inch figures, I just kick myself for not getting them in the beginning. Those are some great-looking figures. But this is all August 16th. For now, take another look at Count Marzo. Still hasn't sold out. Um... By the time you're done watching this video, if you want to pop, pop over to MaddieCollector.com, take a look, see if he's still available. But for now, rate, comment, subscribe, join the revolution. See you soon. Bye-bye.